Uh, really kind of unexpected. Um, you know, it caught me off guard. It went through the lights out there and then uh, kind of banged the blower and, and put the rods out in the pan. And, uh, you know, it, the fire just got pretty pretty quick, pretty big, pretty quick. And, um, you know, you know you got a pretty big fire when you pull the fire bottles and nothing happens, you know. So it's like, whoa, we just sucked up all that stuff and nothing, you know, like here we go. And then the windshield melts in and you're just trying to get out, you know, get everything stopped and get out and stay. I could pick out pieces of the wall here and there, you know, kind of figuring out where I was at and try to stay over near the wall and off a of cruise and stuff. But uh, you just knew it wasn't going to be good because it was such a big fire that your guys were going to have to work so hard that night. And, uh, man, did they, they put in, um, I don't know, they have, I think they finished up at 3.30 that morning and uh, went back, got two hours of sleep and rolled back out here to the racetrack on, on Saturday. And we got that one hit, you know, so... Uh, Basically, uh, it was a planned shutoff. We, he says, look, this is a brand new race car we built. We've never made a lap on it. Let's just go take it half track, get to half track, and, and shut it off and, and see. Look at